It is one of the most eagerly awaited days on the footballing calendar. It's the day when teams turn up for work with a spring in their step. First time in this competition this season, a genuine sense of occasion, a bit of fanfare that goes with it. The mood is upbeat, laced with a dose of nerves, which must be expected. The team news is in, the teams themselves will be with us shortly. The atmosphere predictably wonderful. This one of the great amphitheatres of the game. You are welcome to it and indeed to one of the grandest fixtures. And so, the national anthems. down the gauntlet with that anthem now to match it So a strong start, essential for both teams here as they look to head towards the knockout stage. Yes, and that's very apparent, Peter. Competition football is a different beast entirely. And you have to be prepared to dig deep to prevent everything going south very quickly. So this could be a, a tentative standoff in weighing each other up. I hope we'll see more probing than possession. Got things on the way. Forward it goes. Now it's long. Well played, he saw that coming. Stepanenko. out on the left now that's one way of trying to make things happen there's a few who could follow that example he's got options out wide he's left his man it's a good-looking cross McLean! oh fine stop from the keeper McLean simply didn't do anything wrong. He was thwarted by brilliance. <laughs> Tries to get it clear. Knocks it away. Defending of the desperate variety. Oh, that is up. He's gone for it. <laughs> really outwitted one on one. Once more, he gets the better of the keeper. Yeah, and he knew all along what he wanted to do, and it's a really great instinctive finish.
Ireland take the lead, 1-0. Yeah, this is also a chance to see what happens to their level of concentration from here. Gets wrestled off the ball. And it's long. Over to the left. Forward quickly. And it's played forward. Hoists it forward. And it's McClay. It's a loose ball. Time whistle. And here we are, off they go for half time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half, but there has only been that one goal. It is very, very tight. I'm sure they'll be very happy with the first half performance and the scoreline. They definitely want to maintain the momentum now and finish the job. Ireland leading a cagey game here. It's had its moments and it's 1 0 at the break. And the game has already resumed here. Ireland carrying a one-goal lead. McLean battles to win it back. It's a very good battle there, terrific to watch. Pings it out wide. Now it's long. And he's there to hoof it away. And it's played forward. And long! <laughs> it's McClay. Plays it out to the flank. Hendrick tries to get it forward quickly. And helps available out wide. Long. And the assistant referee rightly gives him offside. Ukraine can make their change now with uh, a break in play. McLean, in he flies! And another time! <laughs> Two up and threatening to pull clear! Long, duly reaps his reward, kept his call whilst the defence lost their bounds. Oh, look, there's only one player who merits all the praise for that. Not only did he finish it, but his instincts for being where he was. Absolutely top-notch. Ireland to get themselves a two-goal cushion. Well, that second goal has given them so much more command and confidence now, and they should be able to take it on from here and either add to their lead or, or close it out. Surely they'll manage one or the other. They're more than happy to take the muscular approach. Regardless of the outcome, it is good to see someone running at the defence like that. Five minutes left. Going for goal! 
good challenge. He just stood firm. Pietov gets rid without sophistication. Just brushed off the ball there. Added time is up, and there goes the whistle. Ireland get off to an ideal start. Three points on day one, and it goes well for the campaign ahead. If you summarise what we've seen today, then, Jim. Well, they've laid down a marker with such a good opening win, and they're saying to the rest of the group, we're intent on staying at the top. On this evidence, I think there's every chance, too.